Hi, welcome to CPAPHelpdesk.com. In this short video, I just want to show to you about heated humidifiers. Um, this one here is the ResMed uh, heated humidifier called the H5i. Um, so, and so that's how it looks. This is ResMed. This is the for the Restronics uh, Remstar series. This is the System One uh, dry box system, the heated humidifier. Okay, it goes like that. This is the Devilbus um, for the IntelliPAP CPAP series. This is their heated humidifier. Fisher and Paykel Icon um, doesn't you cannot disconnect their heated humidifier from the machine. It's all integrated, it's one and all. Okay. Um, I do want to show you one thing is over here. Hiding here on the uh, left hand side, this is the Fisher & Paykel HC150. If you already have a CPAP machine, but your issue here is your heated humidifier is not giving you adequate moisture uh, to deal with your dryness, you can get this and use it with your current CPAP machine. Regardless of which brand it is, you can, for the most part, regardless of the brand, you can use it. I'm, once I can find the time, I'm going to create a video to show you how you can do it. Very powerful. Fish and Paykel heated humidifiers are what we use of, of in many, many intensive care units on ventilators, okay? On, or, or some people call them respirators. But once again, this is a very good option. If you already have a CPAP machine, it's just that your issue is your heated humidifier, the HC150 with a, with a, with a plate. You need to get the plate with it. So that you can, for example, if this CPAP, you can stick your CPAP here and then attach it. And once again, I'll create a video and show you how to do it. All right. Uh, all right, guys. This is it. I'm going to pause for now and jump into another video.